Uh, what's up, everybody? Ginger Runner. What's up, everybody? Ethan Newberry, the Ginger Runner here. Today, we are reviewing a piece of triathlon gear, which I'm really excited about. It's the Cobb Cycling Rapido Tri Short. Now, Cobb Cycling is known for their very, very unique and extremely comfortable saddles. I actually used to ride one. I love them. But they just started doing apparel, and this is one of the first items from their apparel line. It's their Tri Short. What I really like that they've done here is made something super simple, really gone all out, and they designed something that's going to be fantastic for their customers and for the Tri market. I'm excited to see what you guys think about this in the meantime time, here are the things I like. Thin and minimal. The material on these shorts is extremely thin, extremely minimal. I would recommend this for summer or late spring triathlon. If it's hot out there, these are the shorts to go for. Moisture wicking. Now, especially when you're coming out of the water, coming out of the pool, these guys dry off extremely quick. They will wick that sweat off your and let it evaporate. They just do a great job getting rid of the moisture. Pockets. And this is what I would say is the number one like about this pair of shorts, the pockets. You've got one in the back here. It's nice, big, very stretchy. And you have two side pockets, one on each leg, right here that go down. You can shove a ton of nutrition in there, bottles, little gel flasks, all sorts of stuff. And I love that. I love being able to stash phones and gear and nutrition all over my pair of shorts and not have to worry about it. And these are great. Extremely thin chamois. Now the chamois on these shorts is thin. I don't even wanna beat around the bush. It's barely there. It's an extremely thin piece of mole skin. It's very soft. It does not chafe. You barely feel it, but it will take its toll on your nethers on the bike if you're not fully trained and got those seat bones all worn in. The leg cuffs. I love a good thick leg cuff and these are no different. These have a, a, a nice one and a half, almost two inch leg cuff and that's great. Perfect fit. Privacy fabric. Now these shorts are unique in that the areas that have the white fabric, it's called privacy fabric. So when they get wet, when you're coming out of the water, if you happen to have something behind them that you don't want people to see, these shorts do a great job of hiding that with a pattern built into the fabric that kind of camouflages everything. There's really no other way to put it. That's cool. Now there are a couple of things that I dislike about the Cobb Rapido Tri Short. First of all, thin waist strap. The waist strap around here is just a real thin draw cord. I wish there was some sort of thicker waistband. That's a problem that I have, but a lot of tri kits are extremely thin, very minimal, so I understand why they chose to have just a single strap. No secure back pocket. Now the back pocket on these, like I said before, is just a little fold. It's not an envelope pocket, it's just a single pocket that stretches a bit. If there was a Velcro, a snap, or an envelope fold over the top, I'd be much happier. As it is, I wouldn't put anything valuable back there, especially after the swim leg. It's gonna fill with water and possibly pull things out. Another dislike, the looks. Now, the looks on these, is a bit dated, especially with the big cob and silver on the white there. I wish they had stuck with some more current trends with brighter colors, interesting patterns, but they didn't. They kind of went old school. It's a bit of a dislike for me. And finally, sizing. They run a bit large. I normally wear a medium, no problem. Rarely do I have to go to a small. These I had to go to a small and they fit fairly normal. So just be aware that if you do get the short, that you might to size down. So that's it on the Cobb Rapido Tri Short. I like them. Please note that I have not done a triathlon yet. I'm still working on my swimming. I can swim but biking and running I do a lot I have to recommend these shorts I think they're great give them a shot for yourself the Cobb name alone should tell you how good these shorts are so that's it let's get on with the points quality I give the Rapido four out of five I think it's really good quality the stitching is good there's no seams on the inside you get no chafing the pockets are awesome four out of five comfort four out of five the shorts are extremely comfortable very thin very lightweight they wick moisture away really really quickly the only problem that I foresee is that the chamois is so thin you're really gonna feel it on the bike seat unless you're riding a Cobb cycling seat hey yo price at $89 I have to give them three out of five I think that's kind of at the high end of a decent pair of tri shorts. I'd like them to be around 60 to $70, but $89 puts them at the higher end of the price point. And finally, looks, three out of five. I think this pair, particularly the white and the black, is a little bit dated. I do understand why they chose this direction, but if you get the all black pair, you might be in better luck. That brings our total to 14 out of 20, which is a great score for the Cobb Rapido Tri Short. If you have not tried these on, give them a shot. It's a quality company with quality products all around, especially with the tri community, so definitely check them out. In the comments below, let me know, have you tried this pair of shorts? Have you tried any pair of triathlon shorts? What is your favorite? What is your favorite brand? Let me know. Also, be sure to like and favorite this video. Share it with your friends, especially your triathlon 
athlete friends. Uh, I love all you guys, all of us endurance sports athletes. You guys are all amazing. Also, be sure to subscribe to this channel, youtube.com slash the ginger runner. I'm posting new videos every single week. You can follow me on all the social networks, Twitter at the ginger runner, Facebook, facebook.com slash the ginger runner. And of course, gingerrunner.com. All my blogs, all my reviews right there in one simple place. That's it. Train hard, race harder, party hardest. See you guys next time. Peace.